So I'm going to go straight to the point here. Like to come out here for an explosion, but nobody died. No wounded, not even a little scratch. Just a bunch of freaked out kids and underwear woke me up in the middle of the night. It's now 5 a.m. and my wife's gonna kill me. So help me out here, will you? How do we end up in this situation? I truly hope that we will all have the desire to share this dream with us. For the legacy we leave our children, and of course, for your money. Thank you for your attention. Everything started yesterday. Congratulations, kid! You're going to amaze them. We're repeating the final presentation of our project. Oh no, Sean, you know the stability tests haven't been finished, the product is pretty sensitive. Forget about the stability tests. Once you get the money, you do all the tests you want. Sean, can you give me the keys to the lab, please? Sure. You're a winner, kid. Yeah. Can't you answer a damn phone? I told you, I lost my phone two days ago. Somebody must have stolen it. What's the problem? <sighs> We've got to stop Martin right now. Martin? What the hell are you talking okay, about? Okay, so we worked late yesterday night. Um, he didn't know I was there, but I caught him talking about leaving the town tonight. What he didn't mean? even want to do the presentation in the first place. So, well, he just thinks basically that we're going to use him to get the project operational and that we'll drop in once we get the funds. I was with him two minutes ago. Gone. Check the lab. I'll go to his apartment. So he decided to go back to the conference room, and the guy was gone. What did you do? I tried his apartment. Did you find him there? Yes. Yeah, I'm in his building. He already left, and he took the case with the files and the formula. Damn it! Oh, he's here. He has a case. I'll call you back. Give you the gun. Give me the gun, Marty. No. He didn't? He didn't. Okay. Now, give me the case. And what did he do then? The case. Marty. He stayed in front of me, and he started to slowly open the bag. In front of you? Right in front of me. What was inside? His phone. And what happened? That's it. That's it. That's the way it's happened. Mr. Commissioner, I wouldn't dare lie to you, would I? Well, Mr. Hawkins, I don't see any reason not to believe you. The prints on these exhibits correspond with Mr. Goldberg. You need the motive to run away anyway. I don't see any reason to retain you. Marty! Marty! 